Today in Clear Chain, we're going to talk about the sunscreen. Which is the best sun protection factor to you use and what's the truth about this product? Hi, my name is Lucas Sustinoni from Brazil. Every week we have new videos here at Clear Channel with tips about health problems and beauty treatments. And I would like to invite you to subscribe to this channel and receive the new videos every week. So today we're gonna talk about the truth about the sunscreen. What is the best SPF to use? So the SPF, the sun protection factor, it means the protection against the redness. How much time you can stay in the sun and don't get your skin red. So we can see uh, a lot of numbers of this SPF, but w which one is, the, is, the, is good, it's enough. If you take a sunscreen with the factor 15, that's not enough. The best is 30 or more. And you think if I buy like uh, the SPF number 60, it's much better than the 30, that's not true. From 30 to, to more, it's, it's enough. Because uh, the, the SPF number 30 protects against 96% of the uh, radiation, the, the solar radiation. So then the SPF number 15 is not enough. From 30 or more, it's, uh, it's good. Because like the 60 protects against 96% and uh, half percent of, uh, of the sun exposure. So you, you, you are using a SPF much bigger, but the protection is not that big. And why it, this happened? Why there is a lot of number, like 100 protection? Because the, the industry uh, wants to shave you. They, they would like to you see the number, and that number is much higher, and you think that the protection is higher like the number. So that's not true. It's just for commercial purpose that the number is so high. And it's very important uh, to pay attention to that you have to reapply the sunscreen after contact in the water. So people go to the beach and go, go swim and go to the water, and after that think the, the sunscreen is protecting against the sun, but that's not true. You have to reapply the sunscreen after the water exposure. And the other very important thing to, to you pay attention is about the UVA protection. Like we said, the SPF, the sunscreen protection factor, only says about the UVAB, that's the protection against the redness. But the protection against the UVA that causes uh, uh, skin cancer, skin pigmentation, melasma, all these kind of problems and aging process, you have to pay attention with the protection of the UVA that you can check it out with the PPD. It's very important to pay attention that here in Brazil, the sunscreen used to protect you just with against the UVB till 2012. So, like four years ago, it was uh, allowed that uh, say that it's very important to industry protects against the UVB and the UVA. So, you, the sunscreen you have to find this information and label that is right in protection against the UVB and the UVA, the most important one that causes skin cancer and aging process. So it's a very short video today. I hope you like to have a lot of videos here in English in your Claire channel. Uh, you can subscribe, clicking the button subscribe here on YouTube to receive every week new videos that we record for you. Okay? Lucas Sustinone from Brazil. I hope you like this video. I see you in the next videos. Thank you very much. Bye!